All right, so uh, this is the pieces I fabbed up for my fuel cell to mount it in my car. Uh, got an 86 Mazda RX-7. Um, it's not a bad little car. There's some rust spots here and there, but I guess it is what it is. Uh, getting ready to uh, get it all wired up and um, Got the engine bay all painted out. I'm doing an LS swap to it with a six speed. Uh, in the back, back here. I just made some, made a new access hole so when I put my uh, fuel cell up in there, I can easily access the top of the tank because uh, an aluminum fuel cell in it. That's Zeus. Hi, Zuzi. Uh, but underneath here, got new electric fuel pump. I got to uh, get one fitting that goes in the uh, end of the fuel filter right here, so I can uh, hook up my new AN line to it. I don't know the lighting kind of sucks under here, but. I need that fitting and uh, I gotta get a fuel filter for, for my pump and uh, I'll show you when I get the bracket all welded up for the fuel cell and we'll see about getting it fit in here. Alright. Alright guys, so uh, I said I'd show you what I did for a bracket to hold my fuel cell in place. Here it is. I uh, got it bolted up to a set of uh, mounts that I had previously welded on the car. Uh, drilled some holes in it. And uh, hopefully get the fuel cell stuck in here. I'm gonna grab some lunch and grab four bolts so I can put it together. And I'm gonna stick the fuel cell in it and see what we can do. Eh, not a bad looking well for an aluminum MIG that's about 30 years old. Alright, all right, so uh, I got my fuel tank all mounted in there. Uh, this is the bracket right here. Uh, fits in there actually really tight. And uh, works pretty good. Still goes to the factory fuel fill. Right now I gotta make a new AN line that comes off the return of the fuel pressure regulator and goes to the top of the fuel cell again. And uh, then I should be almost all set with the fuel system as far as back here goes. You see I got on the inside here the vent hose. I gotta get a new fuel filter adapter that goes from right there to the fuel feed line right here uh, it's an inline filter uh, Summit has them uh, you gotta put an order in for some parts tonight anyway but as soon as I uh, get some more parts I'm gonna get rolling on it again <laughs> 